In this video, we will see a problem on Thevenin's theorem. Question: Find IL through RL using Thevenin's theorem. Here, for this circuit, we have to find the value of this IL by using Thevenin's theorem. Solution: First step is to find the value of RTH. So, to find RTH, that is Thevenin's resistance. What we have to do? We have to remove RL and turn off turn off all independent sources. Turn off all independent sources and remove RL. So here this is the circuit. Now what we have to do? We have to remove this RL. So let's remove this RL. Now let's say this terminal is terminal A and this terminal is terminal B. Now the resistance between these two terminals will be RTH that is Thevenin's resistance. And next what we have to do? We have to turn off all independent sources. So here this 12 volt is an independent voltage source. Now when we turn off an independent voltage source that time we have to replace it by a short circuit. Now we can easily find the value of RTH. Now here we can see this 3 ohm and 6 ohm are connected in parallel. So 3 ohm parallel with 6 ohm. So if we solve this it will be 3 into 6 divided by 3 plus 6. So let's put this in calculator. 3 into 6 divided by 3 plus 6. So it is 2 ohm. Now let's copy this circuit. Now we can replace this 3 ohm and 6 ohm by a single resistor of 2 ohm. So this resistance will be of 2 ohm now. Now we can see 2 ohm, 3 ohm and 5 ohm these are connected in series. So let's solve this. So 5 plus 2 plus 3. So 5 plus 2, 7. 7 plus 3, 10. So this will be of 10 ohm. Again, let's copy this circuit. Now we can replace this 3 resistance by a single resistance of 10 ohm. So this will be of 10 ohm. Now here we can see this 10 ohm and 10 ohm are connected in parallel. So 10 ohm parallel with 10 ohm. Now their values are equal. So their equivalent resistance will be half of it. So let's solve it in a conventional way. So 10 into 10 divided by 10 plus 10. So this will be equal to 5 ohm. Again we can replace these two resistances by a single resistance of 5 ohm. So let's replace 10 ohm parallel with 10 ohm by a single resistance of 5 ohm. Now here this will be of 5 ohm. Now this 7 ohm and 5 ohm are connected in series. So therefore RTH is equal to 5 plus 7. So therefore RTH is equal to 12 ohm. Now we got the value of RTH. Next we have to find the value of Thevenin's voltage VTH. So to find VTH again what we have to do? We have to remove RL and find VOC is equal to VTH. Now VOC is the open circuit voltage. So again let's copy this circuit from here. Now this time we will remove this RL. 
and this will be our VTH. This will be positive and this will be negative here. Now here we can see this 7 ohm is open circuited. So there will be no current. So that's why this voltage will be our VTH. Now to find this voltage VTH. It is the voltage across this 10 ohm and this 5 ohm. These are connected in series. So let's find this voltage. So before that we have to find its total current. So let's say this current is IT. So let's find total current. Again let's copy this circuit and simplify it. To better understand this. So let's erase all of this. To make it simpler. Now here we can clearly see this 3 ohm. 10 ohm. And this 5 ohm. These are connected in series. So it will be 3 plus 10 plus 5. 3 plus 10. 13. 13 plus 5. 18. So it is of 18 ohm. So let's replace this by a single resistance of 18 ohm. It will be of 18 ohm. Now this 6 ohm and 18 ohm are connected in parallel. 6 ohm parallel with 18 ohm. So it will be 6 into 18 divided by 6 plus 18. If we solve this we get 6 into 18 divided by 6 plus 18. So it is 4.5. Again let's take this circuit. Now we can replace these two resistances by a single resistance of 4.5. So this will be of 4.5 ohm. Now we can easily find the value of IT. So IT is equal to V upon R. Now here the value of V is 12 and the value of resistance will be 3 plus 4.5. So therefore IT is equal to 12 divided by 3 plus 4.5. 12 divided by 3 plus 4.5. So it is equal to 1.6. 1 1.6 ampere is the value of IT. But here we have to find the value of VTH. Now let's say this current is current I1. Again let's copy this circuit from here. Now we have the value of IT. But we have to find the value of this VTH. So to find VTH we need the value of I1. So by using current division rule. By using current division rule. We can find the value of I1. I1 is equal to this current IT multiplied with opposite branch resistance. Now opposite branch or parallel branch to this branch is 6 ohm. So 6 divided by 6 plus. Now we have to take addition of all of this 3 plus 10 plus 5. So 3 plus 10 13 13 plus 5 18. So therefore I1 is equal to now the value of IT is 1.6. 1.6 into 6 divided by 6 plus 18. So therefore I1 is equal to. Let's solve this. 1.6 into 6 divided by 6 plus 18. So it is 0 0.4. Now 0 0.4 ampere. 
Now we can easily find the value of VTH. VTH is the voltage across. It is the voltage across this 10 ohm. And this current is current I1. So here we can find VTH. So VTH is equal to this resistance 10 ohm multiplied with I1. So 10 into I1 value is 0 0.4. So therefore VTH is equal to 4 volt. If we multiply 10 into 0 0.4 it will be of 4 volt. Now we got the value of VTH and we have also found the value of RTH. So we can draw Thevenin equivalent circuit. Now in Thevenin equivalent circuit we need a voltage source VTH. This is VTH and it is in series with RTH. So this is RTH and there will be a load resistor RL. This is load resistor RL and load current IL. And this is called as Thevenin. Thevenin's equivalent circuit. Now let's put the value of VTH. It is equal to 4 volt. The value of RTH is 12 ohm. So this will be of 12 ohm. And the value of RL. The value of RL is here we can see the value of RL is 8 ohm. This is the value of RL, 8 ohm. So 8 ohm. Now the formula to calculate IL is IL is equal to VTH upon VTH upon RTH plus RL. So the value of VTH is 4 volt and the value of RTH is 12 and the value of RL, the value of RL is 8. If we solve this we get the value of IL. Let's solve this 4 divided by 12, 12 plus 8. So it is 0 0.2 ampere. Now what we have to find in this problem? We have to find IL by using Thevenin's theorem. So here this is the value of IL. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel. And also install the app from the link in the description below.